Hello everybody, welcome to this week's game dev vlog on Negative World, the game where jumps are limited. Life responsibilities hit me hard this week, so this will be very brief. I'll try my hardest to give you all a more meaty update next week. So let's get into it. On the conceptual side, I've been drafting storyboards for future cutscenes for World 1 and 2. Not much else to say on this end aside from story details. I really like making storyboards, but to state the obvious, animation is hard and time consuming. Let's move on to the programming side. The biggest update has been the overworld. It animates, and the cursor moves a bit to give it more of a feel. It's the whole overworld as separate frames of animation. I'm pretty sure that this wouldn't be the quote-unquote right or the most efficient way to do this. And I do have a feeling that this will come back to bite me later, but for now I'm happy with it. The cursor is just a simple sine wave pattern, nothing fancy. Worlds 3 through 5 are locked at the moment due to being under construction. Regardless, the reception to this overworld has been more positive than I thought it was going to be. It was a big morale booster to say the least. In terms of new stuff, that's it. Polish List is a different story. Polish this week had a really big push, so, so for the sake of brevity, I'll be going over these in rapid succession. Starting coins are now in 110. 110 spikes of platforms adjusted for visual clarity. Slightly increased the coin hitbox. The cube is heavier when falling. Made a step in 2-2 for clarity. Moved the hero spawn point and made the flying spike faster, both of which are in 2-4. Made more leeway for dodging spikes. Extended the starting platform in 2-5. 2-7 has more consequence. And the flag is now visible at the start of 2-8 to minimize confusion. So yeah, a lot of little tweaks that I'll go unnoticed in the finished product. That'll be it for this week. Let me know if you have any questions or feedback. Take care of yourselves and have a good week.